Yeah, oh, I filled up my bench already. Shoot. Let's go get get the get this out there. And we're gonna go ahead and use Cruel Spikes. Confuse this Mewtwo. So now if he has enough, well, he might not, he might completely miss if he attacks me. So we don't have a, we don't, we're missing Poke Tools. We might have the fifth Poke Tool or something. So he can fill up his bench. He's like, I, I'm stuck. I need a draw supporter. That's. Well, hello, Negros and the Frenchos. It's Donald. Welcome back to my kitchen. And on today's menu, I'll be serving you an updated Pheromosa GX deck list. Yeah, you've been opening Ultra Prism booster packs, right? And these are showing up. Mm-hmm. And wow, two energies to max out. Wow, this card looks usable if you just had cheap, easy tech to back it up with. Ah, so we're gonna update Pheromosa GX to the current era and with the speed the fast setup from this it's it's gonna be very playable so i'm gonna explain to you how this deck works i've updated it and you're gonna see it in three oh man they're very very tough matches they've always been that so if you like those you're gonna have a great time so let us get started today's intro is i'll give you the abbreviation letter as an hint but uh i'm pretty sure everyone knows this every major gamer Mm, and if you don't know, just be quiet, just check the comments, and don't say anything. You'll be okay. So let us get started. Alright, Pheromosa. What do we like about you? She fast. She only needs two energy. She's like, you know what? College, training, eight years? No, I can't do that. I'm not gonna wait to become a stage two, take tons of energies. I gotta go out there and, you know, make a life, make a living. So, here's what, what she does for, uh, let's see, hit points, 170. Oh, didn't go through training, but there is just enough hit points. 170? Yeah, that's equal to Coconut Master, but, you know, that's very easy to KO, so you gotta patch her up. You gotta help her out with the stadium. Ate the Paradise Conservation Area. Build a nice stadium to protect her. Basic Grass Pokemon take 30 less damage. Meaning now you will need 200 damage to KO her. Yeah, that's gonna be a little bit difficult. Well, more difficult because, yeah, you... Any Pokemon have to make sure they have a polka tool or something 200 is will make a game-changing difference over 70 170 say so yeah, it's very easy to do all right first attack well if there's anything that talks well makes her a speed pokemon it's this one fast raid if you go first you win the coin flip you pick heads you're going first you get to attack first right away 30 damage did they have a gx pokemon up front oh coconut master up the front oops with choice man on that's 30 more damage 60 immediately that really compromises any gx pokemon's hit points or any pokemon so it's a nice good burst starting move you really want to go first to get that big damage in so it's a it's not game changing i suppose but definitely 60 hit points on a gx pokemon makes makes a difference so foul her main attack two energies yeah, we can't wait for three energies. Two? Good to go. 60 damage. Oh, that's kind of low. Maybe we can fix that. Yeah, you know about the choice, man, right? 30 more damage to GX Pokemon. But that's only 190, Donald. Yes, you can KO basic GX, but how about stage 1 GX? That's not enough. You can't two-shot a Laurentis. Well, who are you, who's going to help out with that? Well, she's going to go and uh, hire a trainer to help her out. Laurentis. Baby Laurentis. Yeah, sunny day. Grass Pokemon do 20 more damage for every Laurentis around. We're gonna have three. So that's gonna scale. That's all gonna add up up to 60 more damage, which, great! Now you still have the Choice Man too. That is gonna allow you to two hit KO. The base damage is kinda low. You can't really push it that high, but a two hit is what you need on at least on the GX Pokemon. But it's only two energies and any given time. You will always have a Pheromos already. Why is that? You're cheating with Max Elixir. Max Elixir allows a basic Pokemon on the bench. Those two conditions. You look at the next six cards in your deck, find a Grass Energy there. You usually have one if you have 11 Grass Energies, and put on to your Pheromosa. Now this is an item that gave you the energy. It doesn't count as the regular energy per turn. See what's going on? So with an Elixir and a regular energy, one turn. There's always going to be a chance you could get a Pheromosa ready to go any given time. 
So it's probably very, very easy to get your whole team set up for the entire game. Very easily with this. So speed is Pheromosa's forte. And the tech to back her up. Hey, this is a stage one. This is a stadium. Easy card you can throw down. Fast, 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 consistent, consistent. But the limit is, you know, you're working with a little bit lower base damage. That's fine. That's fine. Wait a minute. You forgot about the big part about Cruel Spikes. It confuses. Confusion never goes away. Your opponent has to do something. If they flip tails, they're going to lose that Pokemon. Why is that? Oh, they attack, they miss, they do zero damage, they hurt themselves by 30 damage. That's how confusion works. And you will just cruel spike them away. So, that's the little trick there. Your opponent has to deal with confusion, and that helps keep Sphermos in the game. A little bit risky, but it makes a big difference. So, that is a big part. And finally, the GX attack. If you get two GX Pokemons KO'd, you can... This is your winning move. This is your trump card. Beauty GX does 50 damage for every prize card. Wait, nope, I got it wrong. I got it reversed. That your opponent has taken. So basically, they have to be taking your Pharaoh which, you know, its hit points is not there. Still, it's enough. And towards the end of the game, you can use Beauty GX to just KO that last, you know, the big Pokemon they have. No matter how strong it is, with the help of Lorantis, with the help of Choice Bands, you'll get the KO. It's the Salazzle, though. It's the reverse one. All right, Beauty GX. It's a good GX. For two energies, getting a KO somewhere in the game, it is excellent. Whole kit with the, all these supporters. It's very fast. It's great. So you have a very easy time making Pheromosa work. Now, oh, any other special tech here? Well, we got the new Gardenia. Ah, Gardenia heals any Pokemon with a grass energy. Ooh, we can try this in a non-grass set. Anyways, it heals up 80 damage, and if 80 HP makes a big difference, which it does because of the stadium, oh, if you took 30 less damage, that's 30 that you didn't have to heal. So add those together, you can heal up half of Pheromos' life. And these days, oh man, Galissopod, Soarark, a lot of Pokemons do do that amount of damage. So if you can help her keep her in battle, that's why it helps out. So we're going to try the new Gardenias, and it, it worked out pretty well. I, 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 there were times I was like, I wish I had a Gardenia. So, yeah, you're going to like this new upgrade for the Ultra Prism set. All right, I think that is it. Very fast, very, very, very fast card. We got it. Now let me show you the matches. Here we go. All right, welcome to another. Uh, this is Pheromosa deck. Yep, the whole deck is built around Pheromosa. Yes, and, and let's see, yeah. That we have our uh, we have our Lorantis for support and uh, backup. Let's get started. I'm gonna play my remix of Great Fairy Mountain from the Legend of Zelda: Breath of the Wild. That was the first Zelda game I played ever, and it was a good entry. That was good. Now I, I'm not gonna go back and play the pa past Zelda games, but I'm gonna play all the future Zelda games and all the nice games in Nintendo Switch. So Bridget, we were discussing yeah, I should put Bridget in my deck. Uh, Bridget could be okay. Yeah. Hey, look at here. It's Mewtwo. It is going to be a... Ooh. Let's see how good his Retreat is. Because Retreat is going to be uh, crucial if getting into Confusion. Confusion is my bread and butter here. So, oh, Mewtwo's coming out. So I'm going to Psy Strike or... He'll at least get a two-shot. The Psy Strike, you need three Psychic Energy. So, yeah, this is a little deadly. All right, we get the first attack, which he'll probably Retreat this. Mm, let's see. We're going to play... If we burn up too, too much of our hand, we might not be able to play Wick. You know, I want to get this evolved. I want to be able to attack. I'm going to play the Aether Paradise. I'm going to put some free retreat here. And with this small of a hand, we are just going to play Professor Sycamore. No, no, I see them. Well, he did play a supporter. He didn't play a draw supporter. So he, I get I get the whole seven hand cards are worth of stuff. So instead of... Wow, it looks like I didn't need Bridget. No. I have more cards to play over than a Bridget opener. So let's see. We'll definitely put Banana Master down. I'm not sure who gets the last bench space. I don't have a draw supporter for next turn. But I'll definitely be able to fit my hand off everything. Let's see. I have three Formantis. Can they all evolve? Hmm. One of the Laurentis was thrown off. One of them is in the prize guard. But this will fit my hand, and I can free the extra bed space later. All right. So the one that was thrown off. This might be a little too early to it, but I'm kind of... I really want a draw supporter. It probably is too early for it, but this is desperation. Desperation to pull one more card in the next turn. 
Oh, wow. We could be able to dump our hand next turn. So we'll just go with Fast Ray. That's all we can do. The Max Elixirs all are still in my deck. So I'll be able to rush out that super speed uh, later. So we poked it. Yeah. We, uh, I was hoping for the 60 damage because the, the Choice Man... Yeah, the Choice Man would have stopped it a little bit more. Potentially, if I got everything nicely up, we could have gotten for a one-shot too. So, let's see. I have a Guzma... I don't really want a Guzma now. I have 50... Actually, I don't have an energy, so we're, we're assuming that yeah, I have 50 damage. Let's see, what's your hit point? 60. Can't do that. DCE. Right up there to attack. Yeah, he's stuck. He opened with Bridget, but he didn't get that big extra shuffle there, so we did get an energy. Sweet. Me? I, I don't have got a supporter, too, so let's see. Let's evolve one on the float stone. Let's evolve this right here, too. Banana Master? Yeah, I can pull. I can pull. Let me see if I want a Guzma, though. You know, you're the, I probably I may just deal with you right now. Our damage is now. We could get the Cosmo. We can get the Prize Guard. The threat. There are two threats right now. The one in front of me and the one behind me. This is a little weird. Okay. So you got to decide. This is this is a fork in the road. Do I go for the Mewtwo or do I keep, you know, tr just finish off the Coconut Master? This is weird. Okay, you know what? Let's do this. I'm I'm gonna say Mewtwo. Mewtwo, you are Mewtwo. Let's deal with you. Coconut Master is just bait. The Mewtwo will come and defeat you later. And this gets me a maximum of three card pulls now. Yeah, Banana Master, and we can still dump our hand. Yeah. Oh, I filled up my bench already. Shoot. Let's go get get the get this out there. And we're gonna go ahead and use Cruel Spikes. Confuse this Mewtwo. So now if he has enough, well, he might not, he might completely miss if he attacks me. So we don't have a, we don't, we're missing Poke Tools. We might end the fifth Poke Tool or something. So he can fill up his bench. He's like, I, I'm stuck. I need a draw supporter. That's just luck someday. Yeah, there's Max Potion. I see this is the Lunala combo. Uh, Lun yeah, there's the Lunala Max Potion healing combo here. Adding Professor Kukui wouldn't be so bad in the deck, right? Maybe one or two, but Professor Kukui is, this is my Professor Kukui. He played N, he didn't want to. I was stuck on guards. Not really, but... Okay, so I'll take the extra cards. That's good for both of us. That's why, that's why, you know, we want Cynthia now. Because you don't want ends to help your opponents out. So, there it goes. What does... Oh, wow. You got thrown away? You had to Ultra Ball that? Oh, that stinks. That stinks, but uh-oh. The big, 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 big... That That's gonna help with max potions. However, it's confused. The confusion effect of Farabosa is what makes this deck. If he attacks me, if it completely miss, and it would ruin him. It would ruin him. So, he's had a choice. Yeah, and what Max Potion, you see this Max Potion, it discards all energies. Meaning it's not as compatible with the DCE. He's going to put the Choice Man on the next Mio 2. Is he an extra pull? Banana Master High Five. Getting us the extra cards. And with this hand, I would be able to dump my hand easily and get more pulls with the Banana Master here. Yeah, yeah, I might be okay with the Scarding Energies because of the my Laurentis combo now. Yeah, we can get that, our final Full Mantis up, our full damage is up. This is replacing Professor Kukui. He's like, I'm not going to deal with Confusion. I'm going to go home and attack you for pretty good amount of damage. Actually, he's moving the energies on. It seems safe right now for him. Yeah, yeah. He'll take two hits, but then he'll have to deal with the Confusion again. But he needs, like, uh, that other stadium for free retreat. Otherwise, he just have to keep on paying two energies and stuff. So, right now, Gardenia wouldn't be so bad. So, let's pop the Max Luxor right now. Get this up. I mean, it's the only choice. Now, these two are full. I guess the next attack I would have is Fomantis. Uh, I'm gonna thin my hand. This means I have to play... Yeah, this uh, Banana Master. Unfortunately. Mmm, you want to discard two energies, keep your stadium. My stadium's nice, it's keeping me uh, stopping blocking stuff. Uh, this is tough. Alright, stadium, I'm gonna get rid of you. I'm gonna get rid of you. I think he might not have that many two removals or stadium. But he looks kinda brick too, so... He did play an end. He looked play an end, so we're Banana Master giving me two more bananas. I've been keeping track. Cynthia, thank you, Banana Masters! Even more cards! Even more Max Elixirs! Shoot, all our Pokemon's already charged up. We don't need it. We'll need it for this guy, but we don't have bench space. So basically, you have... You just don't... You take the... That stinks. That stinks. I could charge Banana Master up if I really want to. That's the last... Yeah, this thing... 
I can just dump my hand for even more cards, but I think we're good here. Uh, so that's why I'm gonna use Beauty GX, 100 damage at two hit it. So now, if he does, he really wants that max potion now, just to heal it up, but he has the confusion effect as well. So that's a problem. So yo, you're not stuck. There's Mimic you as well, copycat. Oh yeah. What happens if a copycat's me? I'm not. I don't have that. I'm that big attack, so I'm okay here. I am okay here. Hey, oh, she don't go, bro. It's going good. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah, uh, cool kid, eighty nine. All right, he's moving all that off. Now you gotta find a way to retreat this, or max potion it. But you're confused too, so I'm okay. Does there's that max potion? I don't know how many you can squeeze in this deck. I'm thinking that three might be a legit number. There might be four. I mean, there's up to four. So there might be one or a couple more. He putting, he's actually putting energies back. He's like, you know, if I attack, it's worth it. Yeah, it's worth it. Ultra Ball. Now there is no more bench space, nor nothing that can evolve. But maybe he's just thinning. He just wants to thin, or he discarded a Guzman for that, which is kind of stinks. He's thinning, and they so I can get another extra pull with Banana Master. We could technically do the same thing ourselves, but we have a Cynthia here. We just... I think I'm what I'm needing in Poke Tools. I just need Gardenia. I need Gardenia, but, uh... Yeah, if, if, if my bench space opens, good. I can I can use Feromosa. Alright, all energies are going on. It looks like he's going for an attack, so he has to deal with a 50% chance of missing. It works! He gets the KO. Wow. Alright, that's good luck. Well, okay, we can deal with that. We can deal with that. That means the bench space was open. That means I can play, drop these max elixirs and get value out of them. There's only three energies? No, I just looked, there were three energies in the next six. And now this one, there's no energies. All right, this is my last float stone. If he has a two removal or something, I might want to save it. If I really want to thin my deck, then I just drop it on here, but nobody else gets a retreat. So I'm not sure if that's going to bite me in the butt later. If I want to thin or want to save as an emergency retreat off some for emergencies. You know, so let's go ahead and save that for emergencies. This is my last one. Where are my poker tools? Where are my combat poker tools, I should say? So this is already ready to go. If I charge this up, that means two Pokemons can potentially attack with the next energy. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna go ahead and use Cruel Spike again. You're confused, you're halfway, and the minute he takes that last next two prize cards, like a Beauty GX and destroy something, but I really want to catch up on some prize cards now, and I really want some Guzmas. There's one Guzma. Where's the Palpat? Hopefully there's a Palpat in here right now. Yeah, 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 okay. Well, you're wounded. You can definitely just retreat home, but that's gonna hurt the energy counts on your side of the field. Uh, if there's another back potion, he'll definitely blow it, but two, two is up? There could be up to four, and this deck, um, I don't know. Two is a good number in the deck for minimum. Three? Three maybe balance? Four? I don't know how many max elixirs, but that's probably the thing that's gonna change the fight here. And the confusion, yeah. If it misses, oh, he's got to do something. I'm I'm itching for my first prize card now. Mewtwo gets this this Mewtwo gets the energy. It's already wounded. It's already in the range where this card can get the KO. And then La Floatstone came back to me. It's like, yeah, you might have to retreat this one day. Yeah, because you don't want to give him yet another prize card. Prize card difference is too big right now. Actually, this is based on scale on his, so we want to save that for later. So that's 200 base damage, 220, 240. So with any damage bonus Poker Tools, they're at the back of my deck, or they're all in the prize cards. We didn't really, really, really need them just yet, though, because the damage bonus boost is good still right now. Waiting on here, he is going to Guzma! He's gonna Guzma this card off, and that's gonna remove the confusion effect. Alright, that works! Where's our Gardenia too? <laughs> yeah, well, let's just let it be that one. Uh, he Ultra Ball, he's forcing pulls with Banana Master, thinning his hand. Now, this thing is pretty low. Man, just give me a Poke Tool, I will get the KL. Ooh, look at that! Look at that, there goes the two removal, probably the Stadium though. Or may he make A for both of these. Yeah, the stadium, so he does more damage, and he can move a lot of... If he moves too many energies on, we'll definitely punish that, because we do have a one-shot, unless... Unless he max potions this. You're not gonna max potion this. If you move too many energies on, I, this this, sick, this ship will sink. And this here helps you recover, but it's already down there. Oh, he has a GX. Ooh, now I'm in the, I'm in the danger zone. However, let's see. Somebody with a free retreat out? Yeah. Okay, who do I set out? 
do I send down? Let me see if I'm, I may get another stadium. Let's just send this guy out for now. He's the safe guy. He is the safe, safe, safe here guy. Let's go ahead and pull this right here. I'm gonna end. He, I have not even taken a single prize card this game, unfortunately. He popped this GX. I don't see any of a big burst anywhere. So there's our Gardenia. Finally. So let, I'm gonna dump this out. It's just junk right now. You want another Feramosa up? Yeah, Finn. That's the last Pokemon that could be there. In that case, cards we don't need, we can just junk. Actually, we just we might have needed the bench space for that. All right, so I have two choices that could be out right now. Let me see. My damage right now is with the. I still don't have a. I only have 110. My damage is still 100. I still don't have a Poke Tool like a Choice Man or a Fighting Fury Bell. They're all missing right now. We're gonna go ahead and send this card because it could get the KO. Let's go ahead and just use Solar Braid right here. Take our first set of prize cards. He doesn't have a GX to burst that victory uh, anymore. And this will sink all his energies. Yeah. Okay, I have three Poke Tools. Usually they don't. Yeah, we know. That's just. Weird luck that you have to we're going on through right now. Moving on, moving on. Have you built the Leafeon Lorantis GX yet? You mentioned in the Blissey video. It sounds interesting. No, not yet. But we'll get around to that with the Gardenia. Yeah, later. 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 We did Leafeon recently. Weak and Mewtwo comes out. Now I'll have Gardenia and the bonus healing from uh from uh from, from, from Solar Play too, so that's gonna help out. So Weak and Mewtwo comes out. Max potion, yeah. We still have not popped our GX, and we can still GX this. Definitely. Two GXs. I still need another energy here. But I could just GX this right now. So Cynthia, he's not stuck in cards. We'll be able to take the KO here. But let's see what he does. He is completely healed up. This might be the real final, final threat here. So, uh, let's see. If This is already wounded, though. We do have a very high damage potential on Laurentis. Where's our Guzma? I guess I really should have kept kept that bench space for maybe a Coconut Master. Could, uh, could have done something with that. However, I do have Gardenia. And I do need another energy if I want to use uh, my first GX. So if he's moving energies on, there's the free retreat that he needed a little while ago. I think this Gardenia might be the next good move. Yeah, because we can actually heal 120 damage just damage. Yeah, actually, I want I want another I want another energy though. It's somewhere on my deck. Let me see. Four energies here. Five energies here. I have 11 energies in my deck. Or 12. So I might draw one. I need a top deck in energy. If I want to... I want the four energy KO. That's going to make me a little weak to this, though. All right. Move your energies on. I mean, if I sink the ship, you're in trouble. I can just GX. I can just play it safe and just GX with this guy if I don't pull the energy. I need the Chlorocyte with this guy. All right. All the energies are gone. He's going all in to hurt the Lorontis. Full burst. Okay, so let's see what's in our hand this time. Here we go. Aggressive deck thinning. Aggressive deck thinning. Cut out everything I need. Let me see what's in the left in the deck. There's a choice, man. There's only one choice, man. Well, we know there are the energies I need, too. There's Palbad. All right, more aggressive deck thinning. Yep, I'm deck thinning for Banana Master as well. I am definitely going to play Gardenia. This will help me if he does have a Guzma there. Now let's go ahead and pull two more cards. See what else we get from the next duel. I have two energies in my deck. There's one of the energies. Here's the steam that could help uh, Pheromosa stay alive too. Plus it gives him free retreat. So I definitely play this. Uh, now, the, the choice. You want to discard your energies? Can he get a KO somewhere with this somehow? Maybe, maybe not. I could just GX with this. And then uh, this thing is, isn't strong enough to fill, take that out as well. Four energies, he his damage is 160, 170. That's pretty that's still pretty hard. Let's do this. Let's do it this way. I'm conserver, conserving the most energies of this method. I'm gonna use Chlor Scythe. This should be enough to one-shot it. Actually, actually, oh yeah, I didn't need the extra energy. You had the bonus from Laurentis. What that the 150? One, no, you had you had the bonus from Laurentis. You didn't need that. Whoops! Whoops! Oh, cheerleaders! Cheerleaders, I forgot about you. You have two leafy. You have two. Uh, well, okay. In that case, we could we could maybe even take that out if we saved it for it. So this comes out. I have the damage boost. Let's see. I, I'm still thinking 170 is hard for you. Energy drive. I'm still alive. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He needed 
choice band, actually. That wasn't close. So all we need to do is just use Solar Blade, and that's, with the Laurentis bonus, enough to take it out. There we go, and heal a little bit there. Oh, yeah, Poker Tools. That's what they were. In the on the prize cards. Wow, close, 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 close match. All right, that is that. Okay, so. Uh, let it be, let it be a good game. Very, 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 very good game. Welcome to another Feromosa batch. This is against uh, Satoshi, the one who uh, yeah, asked me to play this deck with stream points. Okay, so I'm gonna get started. I'm gonna play my remix of, this is Cruel Angel. Well, no, we need something epic. Yeah, once one of these kind of battles, you need something intense. So these are the abbreviations to the new remix. It's gonna be a boss battle. Satoshi's the final boss here. Here we go, let's get started. Fighting Fury Bill, tougher you. Play this right here. Cynthia or N. Now, since N, N is less of a guarantee, play the stadium low. He knows what stadium I have. The stadium helps both of us. So, oh, not gonna do that. Nope, nope. I know, what, I, I know what's going on. So, we're gonna go ahead and use Fast Raid. Take this. 40 damage, because you can attack first with the Feromosa. No, I, I didn't get that nice of a hand here with the N, though. Even though, uh, yeah, just get them, get get the more uh, less reliable support out of the way. Why is it less reliable? As the game goes on, and it's eventually not gonna draw me nothing, and I may end up helping my opponent more. Uh oh. Okay. So now they're charging up. This is something that looks like I'm gonna have to Guzma later. No, no, no. It's both Skyla. All right. So, yeah, we'll definitely. I'm not sure you actually see me play, but I play the I play the exact version of Satoshi's deck, guys. I did on stream, so we'll see if it'll be uh, it's somewhere. So. Looking at this here, look at my hand. I just focus on next turn. There's nothing I can play with this hand, so I'm probably gonna Cynthia for it. All right, I do get Banana Master. I take it back. Do, is Banana Master gonna be a good fighter here? He's good for Hoopa in that. If I see a Hoopa or Nine Tails, suspect there might be one. Then yeah, but no, not this time around. All right, well the stadium's gonna help both of us out. Let's see, it's between doing more damage, but I have the confusion effect, so I shouldn't worry too badly. Oh yeah, look at these items here. Thinner time, thinning time, so you know, you gotta evolve, you go up the gum there. And who needs the max elixir? Somebody that can fight, so this has to be for Feromosa. This has to be for Feromosa, because it can fight. Alright, now I'm gonna go put the energy up here so I can attack and use my final attack. Let's go ahead and pull the uh, another energy here. Yeah! Who Who is the heaviest retreat? Right now, it's Banana Master. Stadium or not, he gets to attack me next. Let me see if that's gonna hit the magic number if I don't stadium. If I do stadium, I get more cards. It will protect him, but it will also protect me too. He might, he's saying play a stadium because he might have a delinquent too, so I'd be like, uh-oh. Son of a bee. Cool spike. I protected my, my himself, and, but I got extra cards. Play a stadium. Hmm. It might hit me. No, we did we did shuffle though. So Cynthia, no, 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 no. Oh, okay, okay. Na 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 na. We're gonna retreat. Send out the fresh one. And it's like, oh yeah, I'll confuse you back. Cruel spike right back at me. All right, so we do have wick. Wick will just be uh, it's not gonna probably be good enough. Actually, it's all I have to go for off of. So I might have to do it. We all get the same amount of cards, so I might get three cards that I can actually play. So let's go ahead and do that. I'm looking for an energy to get to put on Laurentis. Oh, okay, well, I can put my hand with this and put more with Banana Master. So this is the only card I can play right now. Who else needs to come up? Is he can I evolve him? Yeah. I already got another one already online. So, Banana Master, get the extra pulls out there. Yeah, we'll save you. For, we'll definitely save this for next turn. So, right now, I am. I think I'm going to deal with the confusion effect. Let's do it. Flip a coin. It works. Yeah. I had to outweigh it. Can I retreat as easily? Yeah, but then I would have to use a regular fast raid. So now we are both confused here. Delinquent. All right. Well, no choice. That sucked. I'll get more pulls of Banana Master. Superod's still here, right? Yeah. Yeah. Get that Laurentis back. I think that might have been one of the only Laurentis I had. So now we are both confused. We could retreat. He's charging up the Execute. Execute has a high energy cost. But he's going to use Continuous Explosion. Heads! Oh my god! Two hits! 
40 damage. Okay, so I'm wounded. I'm wounded. We got the float still. We're gonna definitely play the float zone because that gets me more pulls from Banana Master. Instead of, you know, fighting with these guys. Ah, Cynthia. Okay. We could, if we do it, I think I'm done with the confusion, okay? I'm done with the confusion. Let's go ahead and retreat. Let's retreat. Somebody fresh out. Actually, I think the one with the float zone should have evolved. I'm not sure if I win when I throw it down. They got a choice ban as well, but uh, let me see. I think I might be able to evolve this. I was having. Okay, to be honest, I, I wasn't keeping check. I might or may not be able to evolve it. If I evolve it, I get the KO. If not, the uh, uh, I messed up. Okay, I can't evolve it. Yay! So that means I get the KO with the flower supply move. I guess a choice man. You know, they'll all you might actually you can you be able to use this. So here we go. Let's go use flower supply. And we'll be able to use that those energies and yeah. The float zone should have gone to there. Alright, fresh healthy, fresh healthy Pheromosa, take that. We'll take our first prize card. However, there's a wounded Pheromosa in the back that could easily I know he's got two Guzma, so one actually it's one Guzma. So there's still there's still a chance that this thing can go up to uh, uh, get out of lose that. So all right, Professor Kukui. Yep, that's the, that's the next best source of 20 damage if you do not have Laurentis. Laurentis, 20 bonus all the time as long as you just sit in your bench. Cruel spikes. So now I have to deal with the confusion. This is like, oh man, I should have. Well, you know, getting energies back with my attack is good. Easy, 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 easy. So here we go. We're gonna do this. Put the energy on, but we're gonna use it to retreat. I'll dump the energies off, but once I get, I just attach that energy. Just get those back later, later turn. All right, I need more cards. I need the flow, so I'm gonna play Professor Sycamore. I do get the stadium. Stadium protects both of us. You wanna just go for extra damage right now? Yeah, that's gonna be weird when you have to do well, all this here. Uh, you, I wanna, I'm not, uh, let, me, let me make sure I can play Gardenia before I charge this up. So we're not gonna, we're gonna say no. We're gonna use Cruel Spikes. Do the 80 damage, put the confusion on first. Ah, uh, it's annoying when you have to do confusion, there's confusion. Okay. Alright, here we go. Nest Ball! Banana Master, you gotta come! It is another Pheromosa, but right now you gotta need some the energies and retreats, because confusion is annoying. Now he might be able to pierce through, but if he does not... Like, regardless, this has to go home because of the damage. There we go, escape robe. Let's send somebody with a float stone out, right? But so that card might get hit. You know, you're tanking. You give me card pulls. You give me more damage. I like both of you very much. I really do like both of you. But uh, you have more hit points. You're sturdy. I was like, that's right. I am the man. I am the tank. I'm going to go ahead and take the hits for us. Gardenia. There we go. Heal it up. And it's good for battle. Okay. So here we go. Uh, what do we do? We're not going to try to protect them with our stadium as a backfire. So you are going to live. Uh, this is a free turn. I could keep on setting up, but I'm pretty well to set up, so we'll Gardenia ourselves. And, uh, we actually don't need anything. That energy, I should have maxed Elixir this, put the energy here. And start getting value out of this, but that's okay. That's okay, we're gonna go retreat, send this out. We don't need to help, uh, pull the stadium down, I suppose. Let's, yeah, that's a very big damage reduction. So, if I don't play the stadium, I can two-hit it naturally. If I do play the stadium, I'm gonna have to three-hit it. And that's how it's gonna be. So energy, free retreat. So it's it's endless juggling. Yeah, for energy recycling though, three energies. I know he has a little bit extra energies. So we uh, we'll have to use Laurentis for our, ourselves. We have Laurentis, one Laurentis, so we can just get the energies back. So no, yeah, we all we all have to retreat before the after attack. Hey, Palpad's here, but Palpad, I want to save it for Guzma and Gardenia. Yeah, so I'm gonna save that, so I'm confused now, too. In this case... Well... Let's keep... Let's do this. Retreat! Nobody wants to deal with this lame confusion. Which is lame. Now, if I end... Uh, nah, let's not end. I'm gonna save, okay? I'm gonna save all this stuff here. I'm gonna go ahead and just play Cynthia. Try to set up a little more, I suppose. You want another... We actually have too much energy acceleration. Like, too much. <laughs> we have so many Pokemon that are ready to go. Alright, so we're just gonna use flower supplies. You know who needs the energies? Nobody does. Use the energies on yourselves. 
I could charge up a back line. I think I'm still gonna... I might need it for a retreat, too, so... Here we go. Energies go back to me. Energies go back to me. This is wounded. Uh, and, yeah. Yeah. Could you finish it off with a fair amount of... Mm, it's still pretty much chunky uh, about a hit points. That's 70, but it did something there. She had Max Elixir before Cynthia. Uh, it only works on a basic Pokemon. So I guess it could have... Uh, could have... Uh, Hit my wounded Pokemon. Maybe I held off on that because of that. I just didn't say that. Lose a mean. Able to retreat two, two cards directly back to hand. So probably Professor, maybe Gardenia. If he needs on draw, get Cynthia as well. Maybe Professor Kukui. Or it was, was that delinquent? Yeah, it wanted to mess with me. But there's no stadium. So it's like, okay, better, let's just not play the stadium. We'll definitely heal up. So I will deal with another confusion. And I don't like confusion because if I miss the, miss the attack, that's it. So I'm gonna use retreat again, and I have a Gardenia. I'm definitely good Gardenia. This this is more value. 70 damage. Oh, I'm confused. Who goes out? Okay, you go re-retreat. Who needs the energy? You already got the energy you need, so we'll give it to the Faramosa. Who needs healing? I like you. I like you. There we go. And this should be enough damage. We're gonna use cruel spikes. Get, get another KO. Yeah. We're all juggling our Pokemons due to the confusion effect. Alright, 8th the Paradise. Kinda stinks when uh, we both need it and we just want to go for extra damage to end the game quickly. Yep. Okay, let me get another sip of water. Cynthia! Good, solid, solid. Is that in the theme deck? I gotta check. I shouldn't have checked that. Cause that's very good, cause now everybody can get a good draw supporter. Easily, easily. Alright, execute. The reason I took execute out, it's a little slow. It's very energy expensive. I prefer go go for go for all speed, go for all shortness. We have three Pokemons that are pretty ready to go. And we have to deal with the little we have to run away again. Alright, nobody has a one shot here, right? Yeah. Okay, in that case, we will retreat, because we cannot deal with that stuff. We don't want to deal with that stuff. Here's the energy here, and no, that's gonna help him more than me. You want to recycle some stuff too, Donald? Not really, but we do have the little too many energies, too much energies there. Let's get that back as well. All right, so it is retreat, 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 retreat. Flower supply. Two energies. Where do they go for you? For your own retreat. This is a little painful. It is painful, painful, painful. Oh, what anime you watch? Right now, I'm waiting for DBZ. It was supposed to come out last Saturday, Saturday but I was like, no, it's not. You're gonna have to wait till this Saturday to see Goku's final Ultra Super Move. So, yeah, that's uh, that. Black Clover, Black Clover is good. I read the the only read ahead in the manga. The manga is good. It's gonna be a good. That's a good, 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 good one. Okay, moving on, moving on. So I give out two anime shows. What else? Nope. This is coming up. No matter what, Executor will be the next fighter. So right now this is wounded. If he attacks me again, I will definitely retreat. And I do have enough damage to finish him off. Let's see. 80 hit points. Yeah. Beauty GX. Ooh, I took three prize cards. He's like, no, I'm not letting you go away. Ha. Huh? You didn't think I'd do that, didn't ya? I guess, uh, yeah. All right. We have one Lord Fomantis. We have 80 damage. Oh, that's enough. That is enough. That is enough. Alright, so, you know, I think it'd be okay to play end right now. Would not be, be okay to play this. We have the choice band. I might save it for this one here, because that one might need the burst. I don't definitely don't need it on the front Pokemon now. Uh, maybe retreating with it soon. I'm gonna go ahead and play end. This will get us all less cards. And we do get, uh, we do get, oh, okay, Guzma. Yeah, I'm gonna need to finish these guys off in the next move. So we're gonna go ahead and use Cruel Spikes. Finish that off! 80 damage, exactly enough. Exactly enough. So, my steam's a bit of a dead weight here. And Fomantis, hey! You both fooled the, the baby evolution and the, the, the subvolution. It takes about two turns to get it up, so I can't get it out first. However, he's got the Executor ready. The Lolan Executor. This is bench typing. It can do 60 damage. 80 damage to the bench now. So that means... I'm alive! I'm still alive. Or I can just GX too. It could GX and then I would lose this. Yeah, wait, he already GX. That means he can go only go for Dragon Hammer. He can Dragon Hammer or Tropical Head. I'm alive, so that means I barely GX, right? No, I still don't have enough damage. 
Okay. Here, you need the energy. I mean, GX is still not enough. I'll use the stadium. If I confuse him, I might be able to protect myself. Let's see if uh, I can get up here. Oops. Whoops. Alright. We have three three of you ready to go. I don't know what I need to do. Do I play this and get an extra card? I already did. Do I charge Banana Master up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I barely survived that one. Cruel Spikes. Forgot you have, uh, I could have con confused you too. Yep. Yep, that means I, I have one to treat. I have to, have to switch it to one of my weaker, uh, my weaker Pheromosas. I would just put a smiley face. This, maybe he's not pissing to stream. Oh, the Linkwit! You lose all these! That's, uh, that's okay. We can pull with cool arts. But hey, we're getting close to decking out. Getting, getting really, really, really close. So, Dragon Hammer, confusion! Oh, he was confused, but it went through. Woo! Okay, can you finish off 140 damage here? Yeah, well, you could probably go for the back one. Yeah, it's game. I, I topped that Guzma. I topped that Guzma. So here we go. Top deck this. Work. I think a GX is my strongest attack, or I don't need to use. You don't even need to use a GX Donald. So in case, in case I get bugged or something, that is that. So good game, Satoshi. There we go. Ooh, that was painful because all the confusions we just had were running back and forth and getting rid of that. Good game, Satoshi. Good game, good game, good game. All right. Welcome to another. Actually, this is the very first uh, Faramosa match. Yeah. We're half bricked. We are half bricked because we don't have a. We don't get. A, yeah, we didn't get, get, get much of a good starting hand here. So I'm gonna go hold on anyways. I'm gonna play my remix of. The abbreviations is OO. It's from an anime with two girls in an apocalyptic era. It's not a very good uh, introduction, but that's how it, what it is. So let us get started. Okay, here we go. Holding on, there is the free retreat Necrozma, which combos so so well with Lapras. Oh man, this is a one shot on me. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. As long as I keep this out, yeah. So, he did open up with a draw supporter. He had to discard one draw supporter or something like that. Yeah, so is he stuck this time around? He's like, no, we Banana Master's been giving me ban bananas. Yeah, so we're gonna wait for our own draw supporter. That will probably that'll be a big thing. Alright, and he's like, oh, he's stuck. I was holding on to these, but I should have. I guess I. Well, I was afraid of Field Blower. And, oh, most of the cards I needed just came back there. Mana free retreats into, well, actually this is two energies. He may not do that. It can, well, whoever gets the first hit. So I'm definitely going to keep the stadium out so I can keep it stay alive. Here we go. Let's go ahead and play uh, this right here. Now, nobody else really, really needs the energy unless this can be uh, it. But now, let's save it for another Faramosa. He's got free retreat here. We really want to goose with this out. But this this particular deck does not have a, a card I need, so... Hey, look at this. I got an energy here. Only the first one can evolve. Let's attack it. Let's do this one right here. Let's evolve this one here. And I can get Banana Master up too. Yeah. I'm going to have an end. Let's save this Banana Master for now because I don't really need anything else. I'm just going to go ahead and poke him right here. Yeah, Laurentis, there are no, there are no energies. I would have. I really wish I could have kept saved you for later. But right now, it's difficult for Lapras to one-shot this, so... Yeah, take a little bit of damage here. This Crystal Ray only blocks Evolve Pokemon's attacks. It does not block, uh... Yeah, so if he does get enough energy, it's okay. The secret's right here. Now, what's the problem here is that this and this gives him free retreat. We want to Guzma these out to stop that combo right away. However, hey, you're weak to grass. We can definitely do something with that. So, three energies, choice, man. Luckily, I'll survive. Luckily, I will survive. So, he still can't retreat in... Yeah, again, yeah, again. He's got the Banaphy right here. He can retreat into Lapras. But he's going to Guzma this out right away. That's like, yeah, I can Ultra Ball. I can Ultra Ball with the Coconut Master. So... He knows that's the weakness there. So, they're, 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 they're unfortunately, that goes down the first hit move. However, that's going to put more energies down in my discard, so I can just get set another one back up. So, Blizzard Burn. Wait, I'm still alive. Thank you, Stadium. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Stadium. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Stadium. I forgot that was there. Whoops. Okay, so go, go ahead and add that in there. Well, uh, yeah, I guess you don't have to do, do that anymore. So, hmm. We need a choice ban. Actually, 80 damage. Yeah, we need a choice ban. Or we need a lower Fomantis. Let's see what we do here. You want to just end this? You know, he looks kind of stuck. Oh, why are you alive? You you're supposed to be dead. Okay, well, we might need another attacker. Or we might need another... It's like, uh, no Banana Master. You stay here.
Banana Master, I miss you. I definitely do, because if I might get stuck one day if I don't get you. Yeah, you say, Donald, you want to pull two more cards? It's it's free. It's with Sycamore. Please don't pull me two cards. I can't. That's, you never should do that. Hey, Gardenia. I need the choice man right now. Or oh, I need any Pokemon tools. So goodbye every Gardenia that I had. Well, that sucks. We have another Banana Master, too. We have another Nest Ball. Boom. All right. That means I can get another one of these. Alrighty then, so I'm no, I will not have enough damage to get the KO of this time around. I got uh, I got lucky that I'm alive, but I'm unlucky that I'm, you know, gone. So what do you do? You could save it. You don't have to attack. You can come back later. Let's see, is there energy in the discard right now? Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't have enough damage. I have 80 damage, correct? I Damage is 80, and with double damage, there's only 160. So let's go ahead and uh, retreat. Make you play another Guzma if you want to finish that off. And let's go ahead and use Flower Supply. You can't KO either Pokemon's right now. Now you want to add energy on? Yeah, let's just throw the energy back on right here. Yeah, take my one health, the one health Felmosa is gonna get to come back and make a comeback later. And if we actually we could have dumped, we might be actually dump a couple cards and get pulls with Banana Master, double Banana Master. And we need to actually do some one more better space ward. This kind of Lorantas, because we need a damage bonus. Ninja boy! Uh oh, what kind of secret Pokemon are you gonna be? Yeah, well, this is not gonna. It's gonna be a Mew. It's gonna, he gonna KO himself. Ha ha! You got a free prize. I KO my own Pokemon. Okay. I have no idea why this is a good move. But I'll take it. I will take it. Thank you for the free prize card. I mean, it could have done 160 damage, <laughs> but he's like, no, not giving you two, giving you one prize card is better than two prize, that, that prize card, so, uh, that many prize cards. Moving on, moving on. Does anybody have a Nintendo Switch? Yeah! We were waiting for some nice Switch games to come out, but... So, Floatstone came out, because, hey man, the Aether Paradise, that thing, that thing kept this thing alive too long. So, there's that, we have a bunch of Guzma, our man's is there, Donald? We're gonna do so many bad things together. Yeah, let's go to town and wreck stuff up. Oh, we're, uh, we're okay. He's coming out with this. No, now this is uh, Crystal Ray. It's gonna hurt a lot, and my Laurentis can't handle that. But you know, I don't like this little free retreat combo. This is the threat, though. I should try to get rid of a threat. Now, first of all, let's go ahead. Uh, let's, well, uh, you need to go home. You can't deal with this. I'm gonna throw another stadium down. And I think I may just attack this right now. However, because of this little combo right here, it's... Yeah, we need to get rid of that. We have to get rid of that. So here's free two prize cards. It's part of his free retreat combo. So I do want to get one more cool Banana Master, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. And who needs the energy? I know you're all wounded, but... And I know Gardenia. We have... We'll get you back, Gardenia. We got the Pal Pad just in case for that. So I'll pull an extra card here, too. Professor Sycamore? <sighs> Alright, so we're gonna use Cruel Spikes. Now with the weakness damage, it's enough. Yeah, take that out right there. So that's gonna block the free... That will stop his free retreat. And has a big combo with Necroz, Don't Wing Necrozma too. And it's like, oh, I wish I could get to these. I wish I had Gardenia now. Gardenia's not pretty good. But uh, she she went, she, went, she went a bad mix with uh, Sycamore that one day. Sycamore, what happens? Like, yeah, you know, we were, uh, you know, uh, we were dating, and she, uh, she did, uh, you know, it didn't work out for us, and now we're exes, and I just uh, have this, um, you know, regret, or uh, I can't think of the word. I can't, I can't bring it, bring, make it happen. They don't like each other for that day. They did something, or he, uh, I don't know, something happened between them that was not good. Yeah, let's move on to the battle for them. You can't, you can't, you can't, you can, you're not very good with relationships or trying to make the, 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 the stuff up there, so. Okay, boom, 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 focusing back on the patch. So, that was being the combo with the, with the, this right here. He would have been able to negate my, uh, confusion very, very easily. He still is. This thing still will remove the confusion, but he just doesn't have to free retreat at the moment. He needs a float stone to complete the combo right there. Uh, two field blowers. Coconut masters. All right, any supporter you want. I think you're gonna go for a goose, but it's like, look at all these yummy, yummy, delicious, delicious, delicious uh, stuff back here. Well, it missed. Whatever card he wanted, it's not there. So instead, he's gonna play Professor Sycamore instead and uh, draw until he has 11 cards. There are two goose there, so that makes sense. So what do we want to do right now? 
That's kind of float zone, so everything will get away from me. I do have a Guzma, but I still am missing damage. However, I have my Beauty GX move. I think I'm going to save the Beauty GX move. I just need one more prize guard somehow. Some way, somehow, I just need one more prize guard. Choice man. I could just remove the threat out of here. I don't know. This is tough. Like, I need more cards. I need, I don't have 120 damage move except my Beauty GX. I weak this damage. I could Guzma and take this out. Actually, no, it's going to come out right away. Do you have another energy? You're going to expose that? Hey, man. Hell, that's not, that's not so good for you. If you're going to expose that, okay. So, in that case, you have enough damage to take the KO card out. I didn't know I was going to draw the energy. I'm going to retreat then. We are going to go ahead and do this. Uh, I still have a draw. I still have a Guzma. At this point, we, uh, we're we going to thin. No, we're not. I'm going to keep my Guzma. Guzma's auto win. Actually, it's auto win any anything. I don't need anything. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Let's drop Professor Sycamore. Let's just drop him. Get a, get, make sure I get a fresh new hand. Get some stuff that I need. Oh, yeah. Here were all the stuff that we needed earlier. Here we go. Fresh Pheromosa is now up here, too. We don't think we can get this out. Let's put this because it helps you. Hey, it helps you. Uh, he burnt up a bunch of his tool removals already. We were cautious not to play too much of that. So we will use our weakness damage. Solar Bane, get the KO. That thing was exposed a little too early with the weakness damage to my deck too. I mean, yeah, they're, 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 there's the new Glaceon. Glaceon is exposed to it. Water is now balanced between metal and it. Uh, actually, lightning metal and water, grass. So that is up. My GX Beauty GX. I. I'm holding on to my, my my cards. I'm not giving him any prize cards, so I guess we'll we'll yeah. Actually, he, he's he's safe now because he's got Glaceon up. But he doesn't have actually there is the free retreat combo for him right there. He doesn't have to worry about my confusion effect. All right, we threw away our we threw away our Guzma for that hand. He's gonna play Ninja Boy. He's like you can't play Professor Sycamore. Yeah, yeah. Guzma, I think I used up all my Guzma. My pal pad's somewhere in my deck. We'll find it, but right now we're kind of stuck for that. So we'll just keep attacking. We already have a... Oh, oh. That thing is weakness to me. He, that, wasn't that supposed to be a Glaceon? I was like, no, I'm going to take your Pokemon out. And, uh, yeah. Okay, this card has enough damage then. Because now my choice ban is here, and I will just take the weak damage. It's already wounded too. So I'll just add this in here. There's not much for me to do. We're gonna go cruel spikes, and I kind of want there be with because of the weakness, weakness, uh, weakness bonus. Okay, so there goes the first match. GG. Well, looks like you reached the end. Thank you. Congratulations. It is time we rate this deck. So let's break it down. Here we go. Faramosa. What do we love most about you? You're fast. You got two energies to charge up. Everything supporting you is very easy and reliable to set up. I mean, if it isn't, it's very easy to fix. I think I got the deck engine down, and I know there's always a fair most already. This deck, it's not gonna fail you. You will set up. Five out of five out of that. Damage! You're going for a two shot. Everything is building for Cruel Spike to do two shot damage. You got a one shot GX across two Pokemons, which, how come you didn't talk about this in the intro? You're bad. Okay, so, it is a two-shot, though. You got two GXs, does a lot, and two regular attacks to do about two hits. All right, so that's average. Actually, the, the Buzzwall better? Oh, that thing's just spamming one-shots. I wish, I wish I could say that now, but think times are changing. Set up! How easy is this set up? You know, you talked about that already. It's the unique trait part. You know what? I'm gonna give a little bonus score here. Six out of five. Really? Is it above other decks setting up? Yeah. You're always going to have a fair most already. It is so easy to get a Laurent or something bench. Easy, 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 easy. You really have, will have no trouble setting fair most of up. So, 6 out of 5. In fact, you're going to have troubles like, oh, what do I do with my extra energies? That's, yeah, that's why the scores are, that's how I felt. I had over setup problems. I couldn't, I had more energies than I could use. Okay, so weakness! I'm sorry, uh, defense, defense, we gotta talk about defense first, 170 hit points is low. This is always easy to remove with another Stadium 2 removal, and a lot of Pokemons, I mean, even, even the weaker decks that are out there, don't have any trouble hitting 170. Yeah, so, 
Sugar Kale. So hopefully the confusion and the city will be around in time to help prevent that. But a little bit less than OGX is for sure. The rating. We'll give you a B. We'll give you a B because... It all depends how, uh, I think a lot of decks in the current meta can do with Confusion. Confusion's giving her the edge, and there's just Guzma, there's Free Retreat on uh, Garchomp, there's new uh, Lunala. If you really want to counter Pheromosa, there's something in the meta that lets you remove the Confusion. And that's just the biggest component of that. It's gonna be very annoying, of course, but if you can do that, you won't have no problem with Pheromosa. However, however... In theory, you're supposed to be able to overcome that. When playing actually against this, you know, sometimes you might just get the bad and lucky rolls. And it'll get you. I know, I know. Okay, so, uh, B. The final rating of this is going to be a B. I fairly like it. I definitely would play it anytime I, uh, you know, feel like it. And it's a nice, it's a nice side deck. It's like, okay, you know what, I'm uh, more playing Buzzball. Let's see if we can mess with Farabosa. She'll do okay. B. Yeah, she's scared of the big one-shot decks. Weakness, there are going to be several. Blower, field blower reduces her hit points. Uh, retreats, and me with free retreats. I guess we already talked about the weaknesses. Big damage. Yeah, those are all Pheromos' weakness. Upgrades. Well, there wouldn't be any upgrades. The one I have listed there, it wouldn't be a... You know, make a Pheromosa deck anymore. But she might be a good side grape because of her beauty GX. You know, when things get going, there really isn't a, you know, big, giant, amazing, uh, you know, grass GX. That's, I suppose you have this, but four energies to get this going? Yeah, this is actually a nice GX to squeeze into grass decks, or even colorless decks. So, maybe she might be a good backup just for the GX. And maybe not as a main attacker. Although, she, you know, the deck, she did work fine. You know, just an afterthought on how, how else you could use Pheromosa GX for something else. All right, that is it. What is up for next time? All right, I guess we gotta go. Oh, this is gonna be a tough one. You know, I only have one. No, 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 no spoilers. Mr. Banana Master number two, you're gonna be up for next time. Yeah, you'll see how that goes. No spoilers, don't say anything else about Banana Master. <laughs> Alright, that is it for now. Thank you very much, Integrals and Frenchals. Please, totally, like, subscribe, because it helps us out. And you know you want to see the, what the stuff I got coming for you. Oh yeah, so, I stream it live on Twitch. If you're in the loop, you just know when it is. Uh, sorry about that. Follow me on social media. I'll give you clues on when new things are happening. Usually new videos. My Discord link is right above my head, right on the ceiling. And you can't see the ceiling then? It's above my head on the screen. That is all, I think. Oh, covers. Remixes. They're all on our Spotify, iTunes. More will be coming eh, almost about a month, May. So all these remixes with the weird abbreviations, you'll get them by then. At least the piano versions. These little melody versions. Melody alternate. That's for another time. That's for another time. So, thank you very much, Integral Differentials. You guys take it easy. Stay safe. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.